I would have never in graduate school ever imagined I could have ended up in what I can very much call my dream job. As the visualization scientist for the Spitzer Project, my domain, if you will, is all of the visual side of our science communication that ranges from taking the data that comes from the Spitzer spacecraft and rendering that into the color imagery that we release for the public, but also is taking science concepts that aren't present in our imagery directly and coming up with designs that will help us visually communicate the science that comes out of the project. In a sense, I think it was always my passion to be an astronomer, but it really took me until I got to grad school that I had the realization that, you know, maybe you should just go and go for your dream and do the thing that really you feel the passion for and let that carry you forward and you know, sort the details out later when you get there. For me, that worked really, really well. <laughs> I suppose in a lot of ways that I had to go through the same uh, realization about you know, my, my own orientation as well. You know, Just came a little later in life that I got to the point where I was ready to face that and deal with it. I think any kind of progressive society that is really moving to embrace the civil liberties of its entire population, it has to reach each of these mileposts you know, in, in turn. And so that NASA is now making that part of its policy, I think, has made me very proud to be a part of it.